guys good evening welcome to my youtube channel CWJ so today I'm up with a new video with you all sharing about the new upcoming car that is all about 2023 Volkswagen Tiguan a new exterior was mostly added in this and it has been upgraded and versioned as a powered by a 2.0 liter turbo 4 engine the power train can produce 185 horsepower and 220 pound feet of torque The Tiguan's output like has a to uh, crossover like a small crossover strong contender Tiguan's output makes and it is a basic segment. Gas mileage should be improved. The car gets 23 oblique 30 miles per gallon. Leaders in the sector achieve 40 plus mpg within hybrid vehicles. However, certain competitors such as Nissan Rogue may achieve 35 mpg when equipped with a standard setup. A new exterior was added in the most recent version. The front fascia is modern and appealing and it attracts the most attention. The inside has been modified as well. Well, now it has a unique arrangement and additional amenities. Now is the moment for engineers to do add some spice to the mix. There is just one drive train option for the crossover. According to the reports, the 2023 Volkswagen Tiguan will get additional seats. A hybrid setup is something that every small SUV should have. The 2023 VW Tiguan R, on the other hand, is getting a lot of attention. There aren't many crossovers available in the market right now. To produce such high output, the Toyota RAV4 Prime requires a plug-in hybrid system. Volkswagen does this with a 2.0-liter petrol engine that has been turbocharged. The performance of the 2023 VW Tiguan R will be improved, similar to that of the popular Golf hatchback. to stay up with the competition the tiny crossover requires a hybrid setup it's fact of life but the german make car maker is set to deliver it a 2.0 liter engine is a perfect base for further upgrades however the final version is far away from production the company already started in producing evs from some markets but the release date for the us is not yet set we need to find sources confirming details about the tiguan hybrid and ev before speculating about anything in the future Tigao has an all space office seven seating spots to buyers in Australia also there are more European crossovers available with a third row such as Ford Kuga Nissan Qashqai and Honda CR-V American prefer comfort so the Toyota remains the only VW model for larger families in the United States there are three base trim levels available for this vehicle and you can upgrade the two higher models with an R line features The base configuration is Tiguan S, and it will cost around dollar twenty six thousand. Highlights of this bundle are seventeen inch wheels, six point five inch touchscreen display, and halogen headlights and LED RDR red S. The infotainment supports an Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, while the sound system features six speakers. The SEL is going to cost you at least dollar thirty two thousand and raises up to dollar thirty seven thousand with the R line and AWD. Standard features for the 2023 VW Tiguan SEL are the 19-inch wheels, remote start navigation, heated steering wheel, while the R-line adds leather seats with a heating and ventilating more speakers and a 360-degree camera. The only model that can beat this offer is basically 2023 VW Tiguan. However, most of its rival basically rivals offer at least two engine options, and that might become a real problem. Thank you guys for listening up my video. I hope this video was very helpful for you all. Guys, don't forget to share, subscribe, and like my channel. Thank you. Have.